ticker tape timer. The velocity and acceleration of an object can be measured using a ticker tape timer. The ticker tape timer consists of a steel strip that vibrates 50 times a second. This enables the vibrating steel strip to make 50 dots per second on the ticker tape being pulled through it. The constant time interval between two successive dots on the ticker tape is called one tick. One tick is equal to one over 50 or 0.02 second. The distance between successive dots on a ticker tape depends on the velocity of the tape. If the tape moves quickly, the dots are far apart. If the tape moves slowly, the dots are close to each other. Changing distance between successive dots on the ticker tape indicates a changing velocity and thereby indicates that the ticker tape is accelerating or decelerating. A shows uniform distance between successive dots for a uniform velocity. B shows ticker tape example for objects moving with an accelerated motion. C shows ticker tape for objects moving with uniform deceleration. Ticker tape charts can be constructed by cutting the ticker tape into lengths with an equal number of dots on each length and sticking the lengths side by side in the same order that they were on the whole tape. Ticker tape charts are usually constructed with 10 tick lengths. Each 10 tick length shows the distance covered in 0.2 second and is therefore a measure of the average velocity during the time interval of 0.2 seconds. The shape of the ticker tape chart shows how the velocity varies at successive time intervals. For example, the length of 10 tick increases uniformly. Motion with velocity increases uniformly, that is motion with uniform acceleration. In this example, motion with velocity that decreases uniformly, that is motion with uniform deceleration. The ticker tape chart shows all the 10 tick lengths are of the same length. This means that the motion with uniform velocity or zero acceleration. Thank you for taking time to watch this.